Hey guys, Dave here from Apple Junkies 101 and today I want to show you how to get a Windows 95 emulator on your iPhone. Okay, now, um, first things first, um, this Windows emulator is a bit of a, it's just a novelty, it's nothing productive, it's nothing really, uh, you know, it's just to have a Windows 95 on your uh, iPhone. It's pretty cool. Um, I think the people who would benefit from this would be the, the iPhone 3GS users because it's a little faster. Um, as far as booting up because the uh, the emulator takes approximately 10 to 15 minutes to actually boot up uh, once it boots up it, it works pretty well um, so I mean if you if you're in for you know to how to do it um, I'll show you guys all right so first things first um, basically what you want to do is you want to go to uh, this link here it's a file it's a file, rapid share uh, link all right and this will be the link right here Okay, and then just download the .deb file. Now the .deb file, uh, once you're done downloading it here, it'll, uh, you can put it on your desktop. Um, a .deb file is an actual. It's like a, it's a Cydia app file, as as would it'd be a .app file in the App Store. All right, basically all the Cydia apps that you have on your on your uh, Springboard are .deb files. All right, so once you download that. Um, I'm assuming that you have uh, open SSH on your iPhone. Um, if you don't, you can get that. Um, no re no certain special repos required. Um, and also, if you have a Mac, you want to use the, uh, in my opinion, I use CyberDuck. You can always use Disk Utility, uh, but uh, CyberDuck has a lot more features that, that you can utilize. All right, so um, once you download that, um, just a quick tip, the... Uh, default login uh, is going to be um, the login um, root and the password is going to be Alpine. All right. So once you do that, um, basically what you want to do is you want to go into this Dropbox here. All right. And normally it would be in your in your uh, like when you first open it up, it'll be in your your root var. All right. So just go here to the slash. The slash is meaning it's root. Okay. And then what you want to do is you want to go here to temp the temp file, okay. And then basically what you want to do is you just want to drag and drop it into the temp file, all right. And I have it right here as you can see, all right. So then what you want to do is you want to go up to your Dropbox here, or um, I'm not sure what it is on the Windows, uh, but you want to send the command, all right. And basically what you're gonna do is you're gonna type in. Uh, D package DPKG okay space dash I space botches dot deb okay and then the, but this is what this is going to do is it's going to uh, deep package it into the uh, into your your temple folder okay and once it does that uh, it should come up a bunch of stuff all right um, it's giving me an error because I already I already put it in there all right so now that that you're done with that, um, you can just close this out. And uh, what you want to do is, you want to, if you have SB settings, you can just hit the respring right here. All right, just respring it. And once you respring, uh, it should look like this. Okay. Now, once you open it up, you're gonna have actually this one is the updated one. This has the Windows 3.1 and uh, Windows 95. All right, so you can choose Windows 95, and let me just, what is it here? You, what is it, rotate? What is it, Windows, right there, rotate. Okay. And as you can see here, it'll start booting up. Let's see how long it takes. Okay. Alright guys, so here you go. Um, it took about 20 minutes to boot up. Like I said, the 3G takes about 15, 15 minutes to boot up. It took me about 20 minutes. Um, my friend that has a 3GS, he got his booted up in 5 minutes or so, um, which I mean pretty much makes sense. Alright, so for some reason I guess I booted it up in, in uh, safe mode. I don't know why. Um, but you can see here, um, it'll normally show a normal window uh, Windows 95 pane 
I'm not going to redo it again. I'm not going to wait another 20 minutes. So you guys get the idea. Um, so basically, if you have any questions, just PM, comment, and subscribe to me if you like my videos. All right, guys, Dave here from Apple Junkies 101. Peace.